morning it is 8.20 and um, I'm in the hotel, obviously I just got up, in fact I haven't, I've been up for a little while, um, I just packed all my stuff, I ironed a shirt for today and um, I'm about to go and have a shower, today I'm off to London, um, yeah we're going to the network sales awards for the post office and um, yeah pretty honoured to be invited and um, I've been nominated for branch of the year in our in our size category. So um fingers crossed. Um I wish Katie could have come but uh, unfortunately we only get two tickets so that's no good. Um and um it's also rugby cup final day today. So miss that as well. Um but yeah, funny old day today. It's like excited, but sort of not. Well, not not excited, but like sort of. Oh, wish Kate could have been here. Just um, there it is, unfortunately. And uh, anyway, I'm going to jump in the shower. That's it. So it's um, quarter to nine. I'm ready to go. Bags packed. Got my bag. Suits on up. I'm dressed. So, let's go. Right, so we're like 30 seconds away from the big demonstration on anti-austerity. This is pretty um, epic. So you've got a festival thing on where you need a ticket to get in. But it's West End Live. And then you've got them lot coming this way. Because they want to go down to Parliament for a minute, down past Downing Street. So that's like all the different things in West End Parliament Live. So you've got this West End thing on, and then that. It's um, a bit weird. As you've seen, I have been all over London today. I haven't really spoken on camera because, one, I'm with my mum, and two, um, yeah, it's just a bit weird walking around the street talking um, on the thing. But you can hear some noise in the background. That's my iPod. I'm streaming BBC Radio Cornwall back from, obviously, from London. I'm in London, I'm streaming Radio Cornwall because we're playing in the cup final today and I'm not there. So I'm desperate to hear highlights on the radio. Um, but I'm in the bathroom, so I'm going to show you around. Um, I noticed on the way in we've been given an executive room, which is really nice. Really nice of them. And we have got some goodies. So we've got some freebies here. Some shower gel, an exfoliant, shampoo, some soap. Don't know what them things are. Some 
body milk and some stuff. Take that over again. Couple of towels, bath and shower. Massive great big mirror with plenty of lights. Just cool. So just excuse the noise on the way through, but you know. Um, so we say, we've got a um, wardrobe, slippers, and dressing gown. So, I'll just knock that off for a minute because it's a bit noisy, isn't it? I guess we've only really talked about it because he said from the start, I know my full team for the first game, I know my full team for the. No, knock that off because we're. Mm. Because we're, we're not on. Alright, so we've got a Nespresso machine with a kettle. That's my empty bottle of Coke. Um, so we've got that. We've got a fridge full of free water and a little safe. We've got a bed with. Welcome to your executive room. This bathrobe is for your comfort. If you wish to purchase, please ask at reception. Does anyone actually buy those things? Really? Why would you want that? You know, a bit weird, isn't it? Um, that's a bed with plenty of cushions. Uh, free Wi-Fi. Thank you for that. There's a boss I um, boss docking unit, but it's got an old connector. Find that a lot in hotels. Old connectors. Um, here's the Nespresso stuff. So a couple of types of coffee there. Uh, little cups. You see a sofa. Workstation. Let's have a look out the window. So outside. Don't know if you can see that right down there at the bottom. Down there in that bottom corner is all the big red post office signs. That's because of the the do that we're going to tonight. I've said this is like the hotel. It's a massive, great place. So um, and this is like the central square outside. There's another entrance. That's just the back entrance. But there's another entrance around the front. And uh, yeah. It's a massive great place. So that's the room tour done. Um yeah, and that's it for now. I'll speak to you shortly. Well it's twenty past five. Um I'm not happy. We've just been beaten in the cup final. It's the only competition we've ever been unbeaten in. And we've now been beaten. Forty nine points to twenty four. And uh I've got to put a a smiley face on. Get in the shower, put my tux on, and um, yeah, go and have a lovely evening at this awards day. God, <laughs> there's nothing I can do. I think that's the disappointing thing. Getting beats one thing, not being able to do anything about it, it's quite frustrating. But you know, these things happen. Wow, the heavens have absolutely opened. It's tipping it down out there. Absolutely pouring it down. But on the other hand, I'm ready. Um, I'll give you a little preview. Let's go and have a look in the bathroom. I'll show you that way. There you go. Can you see me? Am I looking alright? Fingers crossed I'm looking good. And uh, yeah, ready to roll. Burton and Lonsdale. Hey! 
happened we just won the um, central centrally supported branch of the year for 2015 Woo -hoo -hoo. Um, I am absolutely steaming drunk I do not care I am absolutely amazingly happy I wish Katie was with me I'm about to go and dance to Sophie Alice Baxter I'm in my room because my mobile phone is about to die and yes I'm gonna go and do this See you soon, see you soon. Uh, see you soon. Basically, this is how it is. Because we won the branch of the year for our category, we have been invited to the VIP lounge to meet Amy Wilson. Um, not Wilson, Williamson, Williams. Amy Williams, who's an Olympic gold medalist. And um, we can have our photo with the Olympic gold medalist. So I ran upstairs to put my phone on charge because it was dying. And I'm coming back to go and get it. So hopefully we can get a selfie. Um, yeah, basically I'm having an absolutely epic night, and um, I'm pretty drunk as you can see, because I'm walking around talking to a camera, and I don't care, because I'm loving it, absolutely loving it. <laughs> 